Welcome back to Bespoke Addict. Um, yet another pair which I've um, I've got on eBay, uh, on eBay UK at no reserve. These are bespoke alligator skin. I don't recognise the bespoke maker. Um, they have the codes. Let's have a look. Yeah, the codes are written. I'm not sure if the camera can pick it up. The limited light here, written on the soles, and then they're also underneath the tongs here. Um, just underneath there, the bespoke codes. I don't recognise the codes. I don't recognise the construction techniques and the workmanship. Um, they're there, the bespoke order numbers, but they're not. Um, they're not of a bespoke maker I recognise. But anyway, they, they are nice. They're very nice. The, the skins are very soft in lovely condition actually but the original soles original heels um the, 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 the inside's all in good condition they're lovely things um there has been in the past i bought these a long time ago with some damage to the skin um see alligator and crocodile it, it, it does have a tendency to separate between the scales it doesn't tear through the scale itself but it can tear between the scales it's the very soft skin between the and it, it can rip and they had sort of torn here on the corner um the way to repair it is to insert a piece of very fine leather through the through the hole and you spend some time with cocktail sticks and pins just seating the leather then you use the pins to get adhesive through and you can slide you can slide it all back together and it makes a permanent repair so there is actually a patch on the inside so that will never tear again i've worn these quite a lot and it's never got any never got any worse it's never reappeared so to be fair if i just sold these the chance of anybody noticing the rip is very 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 slim indeed you know because of the texture it's kind of wrinkly between the scales and that's the skin that that, that tears and when you push it back together with a decent patch behind it you know it make it, it just makes a very very discreet repair and um, this one wasn't damaged. This one was, but and you know I need to be honest with the listing, and um, it, it is what it is. You know, the, even the finest skins and one of the finest makers do, they do they do perish. And uh, it was probably lack of nourishment, lack of moisturizer. Um, you do have to nourish alligator and crocodile, and in particular the the the, the, the cream go. It doesn't so much. The, the cream doesn't really penetrate the scales themselves. It's quite impervious. This cream goes into the crinkly bits between the scales, and it's you, you have to sort of stir it in, and, and it goes capillary effect behind the scale. Um, but, that, but there's lots of uh, lots of videos on my uh, Instagram and YouTube demonstrating that. And I would guess that that's really what had happened. Somebody bought these and had worn them and didn't nourish them, and it, and it, it, it dehydrated and cracked. But you know, I've nourished and nourished and nourished these. They are extremely well nourished now. Very, very unlikely to happen again in the future, unless whoever buys them doesn't nourish them. But um, they are lovely things. But uh, I've put them on eBay UK at no reserve. They're a bit, just a bit too big for me. They're a little bit long and they're a bit wide. Um, I've really enjoyed wearing them, but I've had to wear them with with a thick insole, you know, because it's been obvious they don't fit me. They, it's all baggy on the vamp and so on. But with the thick insole, I'd sort of got away with it. But honestly, truly, I've got so many similar shoes that fit me better. Not necessarily in better condition, but they fit me better. So I'm, I'm, I'm getting rid of the ones that just don't fit me quite so well. So, uh, I think I've, you know, this is about the 24th or 25th pair I've listed. Um, so I am getting on with this and, you know, I'm, I'm doing quite well with the selling. You know, it's, I've been talking about it for years and not done it. I've not had the courage to do it, but I've finally taken the plunge and the sales are going quite well, thankfully. Um, but yeah, this is this is the next pair. They'll find a good home because they are very pretty, very pretty.